What's up, what's up, everybody? My name is Damian Wendigo. Welcome back to another episode of Project Cat. Now, last time it actually crashed on us, and hopefully this time we can do a little bit better. I'm gonna light these, light these up, and then we're gonna we're gonna figure out we're gonna figure out what this summoning the demon is. Don't crash. There it goes. Everything's ready. All that's left is to wait five minutes, then burn the hair. This is going to be such a pain to clean up. Last time, this is actually where we crashed. Duh. It's so cute. Oh, yeah. Well, seriously, stop messing with things. But everything I mess with ends up being a scam. What if someday it isn't? What if you end up summoning some ghost or the devil or condemning your soul to an eternity in the netherworld? What if your soul is already damned? Then I guess that's what... Then I guess that's what's waiting for me after I die. And this is very loud. I can barely hear myself think. Then I guess that's what's waiting for me after I die. Cat! It was a joke. You're not gonna find him this way, you know. You'll just do whatever you want no matter what I say, won't you? It's possible. Stubborn idiot. I prefer ambitious idiot. So will you tell me where the letter is? You exhaust me, cat. You know that? And yet, here we are. Fine, you win. It's in the occult club. There's a golden envelope in one of the drawers, but that won't let you sniff around since you're not a member. Thanks, you're the best. Huh? Is there somebody at the door? Burn the hair tuft on the candle. Hold on, let me see if the drawers. I saw that. Some small plants, their existence is quite something. The drawer underneath is empty. There's a golden envelope in the drawer. These are the instructions for the ritual I'm doing. Thankfully, I shortened them when I wrote my notes. Read the full ritual rules. Yes, I will. The mess you must play alone. Requirements. Three dark adjacent rooms. Twelve candles. A lighter or matches. A rune. A tuft of human hair. White chalk or white paint. Preparations. Start after the sun has set. All three rooms must be pitch black. Turn off all the lights. Draw the curtains and close the doors. Using the chalk or paint, draw a path going through the three rooms. This path will serve to connect your current location to your destination. In the middle room, place six candles on each side of the drawn path parallel to it. Instructions. Light each of the candles and let them burn for at least five minutes. From this point, you can no longer abort the ritual. After the five minutes have passed, burn the tuft of hair on one of the candles. Proceed to blow out all the candles one by one. When the last candle is put out, quickly close your eyes and count to a hundred. Open your eyes. To remember, you must always close the door behind you. Leaving it open may attract unwanted attention. Do not let the rune out of your possession. It is your only protection. Do not bring any weapons with you. If you arm yourself, so will they. Should anything be heard or felt while you count to a hundred, it must be ignored. Do not open your eyes. Do not turn on the lights. Do not move. It is normal to feel like you are not alone. You won't be. Do I have anything in my possession? Should I... I guess I can't drop that, can I? Is... Well, hopefully that's not considered a weapon. Let's go. This door is shut. There's a handprint on the window. Was this always there? 
All the doors are shut. All right. Let's do this. All right, now I just have to blow the candles out one by one. Huh? The candles? I guess I should count to a hundred. One, two, three, four, five. Twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty. Why am I doing this? This ridiculous game couldn't possibly work. Fifty-five, fifty-six, fifty-seven, fifty-eight. I wonder if Mom is wondering where I am. Huh? What was that? Don't you open your eyes. Seventy-nine, eighty, eighty-one. What's all that noise? Is there anyone there? Don't you move. 97, 98, 99, 100. So, I open my eyes. Ooh. It worked. It worked. It worked. I can't believe it. This is incredible. But where am I? It's a hallway. It definitely isn't the school. This is unbelievable. How could it have worked? It doesn't make any logical sense. I was in the classroom a minute ago. Have I gone mad? This is so exciting. I can't believe it worked. It did work. If I wake up from this and it turns out to be a dream, well, that would be disappointing to say the least. Okay, I definitely need to get need to check this place out. Objectives updated. Explore the strange place. Which way shall I go? A door with an odd pattern. It's locked. A door with an odd pattern. It's very locked. A black substance drips down from above. Whatever it is, it looks disgusting. Hey, a small door with an odd pattern. It's locked. Hold up, left, or up, right to climb the stairs. Hold on, let's check this door. A door with a glossy finish, it's locked. Ooh, I don't think I want to go there just yet. I saw it in my eyes. A door with an odd pattern. Okay, so we're just cycling around now. All these are locked, so let's go up the stairs. A fairly normal looking door, it's locked. A door with an odd pattern, it's locked. So we have a lot of locked doors here. Glossy finish. It's strange. Have I already passed through here? Yes, you have. I have. Hmm. There must be something I missed. Did we miss something? Nonsensical pipes running all over the place. They're warm to the touch. Is this some sort of heating? Hey, wait a minute. It wasn't this long before. Wait a minute. Hmm, am I lost? I don't remember this hallway being so long. There's a key hanging from a hook. I'm going to say no at this very moment. There's a key hanging from the hook. Let's not do this. Is it going to force us to take the key? Is it going to force us to take the key? Let's see if we can go back. Or is it going to keep repeating the same key 
over and over until we take it. Now it'd be game design. Yep. It's a key. Take the key, I guess. Fairly normal looking key. <clears throat> That's not the door. The door we're looking for is the fairly normal looking door. Because why not? Why wouldn't it match? The key fits. Huh? What is this? Am I back at the school already? A paper slip with some rules and regulations. No running, no screaming. Let's have some fun, shall we? Entertain me for a while. And in return, get nothing. Yeah, no running in the halls. Do you even know where you are? You chose a one-way trip to hell, kid. It crashed. It crashed again. Well, that sucked. Can I bring it back up? Where are we going? Where are we going, bruh? You didn't think this far. Now that you can prove that these rituals work, you have no way of going back to tell anyone. The knowledge will die with you. Are you lost? Is that what it said? Yeah, well, I guess it is. Run, 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 run. Oh, snap. Okay. You should give up. You'll never leave this place. Um, what? Your mother will be de devastated to learn that she's now completely alone. No husband, no daughter. Everybody left her. How pitiful. You couldn't tell your father goodbye back then. And now you won't get to tell your mother goodbye either. What if I told you that someone you know is in here with you? Would that make you hopeful? Relieved. I know what you're thinking. Then I can escape with them. But these rituals have no way back. They were never designed that way. Yeah, um... I don't know if I could cross over those. I guess you can. After all... Why would you give your prey an escape? Oh, snap. And here you are, a poor little lab mouse stuck in a maze. You only have until I decide I'm done playing around with you. And then... Snap. <laughs> no. Don't do that. Oh, no running in the halls. We can't run in the halls.
no running in the halls. We can't run. That was against the rules. And then again, I've already failed those rules. So if it's keeping track of how often I run, well, how would you like to stay trapped in here until you die? What? Do you like it? I think it's just what you need. I'm stuck. Maybe now you will reflect on the stupidity of your actions. In the meantime, I'll just watch you rot away. Shut up, that's enough. Whoever you are, get out of my head. My life is my business. My decisions are mine alone. Let me out of this place. I know there's a way out. There has to be. Please, there must be a way. I want to go home. I'm out. But I'm still in this hallway. I don't like this. I need to get out of here. All right. Um, I'm going to end it here. I finally got past that weird crash and plus another crash. I don't know, but this is a good game. I really like it. So uh, I'm going to end it here. I'm calling it, you guys. Until the next video. You, uh, Well, hold on. But I'm going to call it. If you like the video, go ahead and leave a like, comment, and su consider subscribing if you want to stick around and just hang, just chill, because we all chilling now. Are you chilling? This really cringy. Okay, you guys have a wonderful night. Bye bye. God, I keep on doing that. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.